Hello, Bad to Music followers. Welcome back. So the first place I have is McCallum Bagpipes. These are one of the biggest manufacturers in the world. Um, they're based in Kilmarnock, Scotland. So you can see right here, this is from, um, from uh, one of their uh, brochures. And on this page, if you go here to Bagpipes and McCallum Pipes, then you'll get this. And down here, when you get a it says get a closer look, you, don't, you uh, bring up their digital brochure and they have uh, three different ones. And if you look at this, this, this looks pretty sick already, like excellent <laughs> graphic design. Look at all the bagpipes you can get. So bagpipes, deluxe ones, and then engraved patterns, etc., um, like this right here for like Celtic knots and things like that. And then you get uh, pipe chanter reads down here and a whole bunch of different uh, miscellaneous items. And then you get practice chanters down here, um, either all plastic or blackwood. So there are a few different um, selections for you to get. And if we go through here, these are the pipe chanters that you can get with a few different uh, customizations. And uh, let's see here, oops. Oh, and then these ones are the regular bagpipes, like uh, AB1 bagpipes, uh, they're African blackwood. Now, some of you may be familiar with the terms African blackwood and uh, polypenko, um, or poly for short. African blackwood are what most people want to get. However, they are typically quite a bit more expensive than the uh, poly ones because the poly are um, plastic and the blackwood are, as the name implies, they're made out of wood. Blackwood. Blackwood is a very dense material and um, pipes that are made out of blackwood material give uh, quite a bit of a different sound than poly pipes do, um, but the price tag comes with it. But if you get a good set of pipes and get them all set together and you get a good sound going, you honestly, I've been playing um, African blackwood uh, bag pipes for years, uh, passed down from my mother and my uncle, and I have never been disappointed with uh, the sound that I get out of those things. And if you see my other videos, you'll know what I mean. So I'm gonna get out of this one, that's uh, McCallum. I'll leave all of these links uh, down below as well so you can uh, take a closer look for yourself at your own pace. Here is Henderson's uh, bagpipes. So let's go into bagpipes and small pipes and you get all Highland bagpipes and then you get uh, poly bagpipes and then bagpipe accessories and then bagpipe uh, pipe chanters and practice chanters. Let's go into uh, Highland pipes first. <clears throat> So you get a few filter options here, and then let's look at Dunbar bagpipes, which um, will act, which uh, these are here as well. So nine hundred forty nine dollars. Now we'll look at this a little bit closer, but this is not the same price as you're going to get from Amazon or eBay. So you, you got a few different pictures going through here, and then um, uh, you get a few different included components at different prices and things and then it gives you product details, bagpipe warranty lifetime. That is excellent, and I don't think Amazon or eBay gives those, but then you got the uh, poly uh, material and everything else, and then you got a few different uh, products down here as well, and then look at the price differences. So McClellan and Peter Henderson, Peter Henderson are phenomenal pipes, and so are McClellan. They're both uh, not far off from uh, each other in price, so that's more what you want, and there's a few different um, uh, customizations that you can do but I encourage you to get a hold of them personally to determine what kind of pipes you want to get from them let's move on to Dunbar now Dunbar here you can see that these are pulley um, the, the pulley plastic pipes and it gives you a few different um, options and then if you go sh shop online let's go into beginner packages now here is one of John Cairns' books, and he's uh, my current teacher, and uh, he's written a big um, um, uh, series <laughs> of bagpipe instructional tutors, and they're on his uh, website, and I'll post, post that down below as well. Here you get a few different options. So let's look at the regular practice chanter for this one. This is one of the ones that has been around for a while. You get the regular practice chanter, the read, and a book and a CD. Although I don't know how many uh, people are using CDs, <laughs> a lot of a lot of things are digital nowadays. But that's, I mean, look at the price tag: one hundred twenty-five dollars for the for that alone. So, other sources like Amazon or eBay are gonna cost as much as thirty bucks. So you get what you pay for, and then it gives you a little uh, description down here, 
and then uh, all this stuff and so forth. So um, regular practice chanter is 18 and a half. The child's practice size chanter is uh, 15 and a half. And then the long one is about 20, 21 inches. So that's what you're gonna get with that. So let's move on to the Piper's hat. And this one it comes with a lot of different things and it doesn't really matter who you go with. A lot of these um, suppliers are going to stock very similar products. So here you get a bagpipe tutor book and a college of piping. Um, it says National uh, uh, National Piping Center. So sl slightly different, <laughs> but National Piping Center and College of Piping, they're both very reputable um, uh, places to get piping supplies and things. And then you're going to get the standard size pipe um, uh, practice chanter with the two reeds. And then it gives you all of your um, selections and options down here as well. And then David Nail Bay Pipes from Tartan Town at the top here. Look at the price tag, 1600 1900 1400 So, and then you get as low as 850 So you got a few different options here as well. You can take a look at those um, at uh, your own uh, pace. Now we're gonna get into Amazon and eBay. And I've chosen a few different um, uh, options that I think you need to know about because the thing that you will probably notice is that if you look at these and then look at these, they look very similar, right? If I bring this up, see, see this and see this, they don't look much different, do they? There's a little bit of difference with some of the aesthetic features of it, but honestly, these two could, are very comparable uh, visually. What I'm gonna point out <clears throat> is that because of the quality that you get from these, and from my experience, I would honestly avoid getting anything off of eBay, and one of the biggest factors that I've mentioned more than once is the price tag. Look at the price tag. 200 bucks and that doesn't include shipping which typically is between uh, 20 and 70 bucks depending on where you're coming from so scottish grade scottish great highland bagpipe full synthetic bag which i i am uh, reluctant to believe and uh, the finest seasoned rosewood ha 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 one synthetic drone reed one cane drone reed two cane pipe chanter reeds one uh, pra practice and they didn't spell that uh, right practice chanter with two practice chanter reads one carrying case one tutor book etc an assembly book and then uh, may I don't understand how they think that uh, this is supposed to spell a maintenance <laughs> but big pipe hemp which is not even really the same hemp that you would get in uh, from a reputable source so one synthetic drone read so you have three drones you have Eeny, Meeny, Miny, and then Fred. No, I'm kidding. Eeny, Meeny, and Miny, you have three drones, so you should have three synthetic drone reads. This has this says it has one. So right off the bat, it's not, even, it's not even accurate as to what you get with it. So because of the price, stay away from it. I know if, um, if, if any of you are like cash strapped, and I know we're coming out of um, a COVID um, time frame. I know it's still around, and 200 bucks would be visually much more appealing than say 2,000 or 1,500. And I get it. I totally get it. For time and um, frustration purposes, to avoid having either of them, uh, too much time or any frustration whatsoever, just stay away from this. Honestly, from experience, you're not going to get anything like this. It's going to be absolutely terrible. Um, and the sound that you get and, and the practicality of it is just not going to last. On another one on, on eBay, or uh, Amazon rather, eBay will come in a moment. Here's another starter kit from Amazon. And you get it shows a few more things that you're going to get here. You get the uh, black drone reeds that you see at the bottom there. And then the cane reeds. And this is actually a very bad picture. Because um, as the son-in-law of a, of a photographer... <laughs> um, they would, my father-in-law would look at this and go, that is, an, that's absolutely terrible because it's not even in focus. But you get a few different um, uh, <laughs> corks, and then you get a vel for your blowpipe, which a lot of um, uh, places, uh, which a lot of kits uh, don't give on sources like this. And then you get your hemp, and then you get a few different things. Oh, and then it shows you this as well. So this is very similar, and all of these... Um, Tutor books and assembly books, if they come with them, 
are all going to be very, very different and their information is going to be a little bit questionable. Another one on Amazon, and I actually think that this one's okay because it's R.G. Hardy, uh, right there, College of Piping, R.G. Hardy, and, and 200 bucks for the chanter in the book alone. Forget the pipes. So right off the bat, for what you're getting, this is actually a pretty good price. And um, College or National Piping Center is the book that you get, and we've seen these um, in other sources that we just looked at. And then your twist trap um, um, practice chanter and a twist trap. We won't get into an explanation of that. Um, just look it up in uh, Google uh, twist twist trap bagpipes and you'll find it pretty quickly. Two quality reads included. Yes, they are two quality reads. I agree with that statement. Let's get into eBay now. My favorite place on earth. I'm kidding. <laughs> That's not even in Disneyland anymore. Black. Bagpipe Scottish Great Highland Rosewood Bagpipes Tutor Book and Bag, sixty-five bucks, uh, or sixty-five pounds. Pardon me, hundred and three bucks. So, because now I want to point to, I wanted to point this one out because this one says it comes from the UK. So we typically think of bagpipes that come from the UK as reputable. That's not entirely accurate. Now, with this set of bagpipes. Look at the reads. I don't know if I can't think of anywhere else I would get reads from um, from any of the local suppliers that I go to. Then you get um, the corks and the um, uh, the drone reads and everything, and it says free UK delivery. That's fantastic. Thank you so much. I appreciate the free delivery. However, being even even able to get the product is um, is important, and the first set of pipes I bought off of eBay never showed up. So thankfully I got a refund for them and the other ones took about a month. So $65 for these. And it's, if it says uh, last one, like it says right here, I don't believe that it's three, seven sold. The ones that I got from eBay uh, before I did my review, those ones were about 130 bucks. They, they took about a month, but then it said that there was only like 10 left, and then suddenly it went to a, like a, like a tri double, a higher double or triple digit. So they keep making them. So don't kid yourself that uh, if you think that um, they're just going to be depleted, that's not going to happen. These guys, these guys make a killing of selling these bay pipes, which frankly are not good quality. And uh, your bay pipes, your bay pipe drones shouldn't come like this with uh, the drones um, nestled down like that they should not come down that far and they should not be shipped like that which frankly in most cases they typically are so please stay away from them 20 pounds to ship I mean that's that's almost 40 bucks Canadian that's crazy see like 31 bucks now they look at the seller information rampage sports and surgical that should give you a, a bit of a warning sign as to um, what kind of product you're gonna get because rampage sports and surgicals there you don't even see bay pipes up here these guys are mostly selling apparel which is very hit and miss i've seen the reviews they're honestly not the greatest uh, 179 negative reviews and even though their their positive reviews are typically for the um uh for the clothes that they sell bay pipes are bay pipes are just not um good from these guys so we'll move on to the next one and here you get 950 bucks for a set of Archie Hardy um, uh, pipes uh, for 1960s. The only thing that I noticed with these ones is right here. You notice the cracks on the th on the middle drone. That crack is extremely huge. So now I read the description. These ones have been sitting as a wall ornament, but 950 dollars for these things when they got a crack like that to me is just is just too much. So be careful with stuff like this. Um, you honestly want to, okay, that looks like a little bit of a better pipe bag, but you want to be very wary about what you're getting off of eBay because eBay is just so sketchy. You don't tip, you, you don't know what you're gonna get until you get it because even the picture, it typically is, um, is not, uh, it's not accurate. The items that are in the picture uh, won't be the same as what you see and you have to go through eBay uh, money back guarantee and quite often if you uh, message the seller like I have in the past you have to get eBay involved to even get a response out of the seller so 
I wanted to go through a bunch of these because it seems that a lot of people are um, just, they're asking where to find good quality bay pipes and I'm happy that you're asking that because I want you to get the best bang for your buck. And if you have to wait for a month for shipping, if it's uh, from an out of town source, which, it's, uh, which it typically is, then you're going to get the best um, deal and product for the weight. So I will post all of the links uh, for the uh, reputable sellers uh, down below in the description. And I hope that this video cleared up any questions um, or concerns that you had. If you have any questions about anything that we went over in this video that I haven't discussed that you're interested in, please leave them down below in the comment section below. Send me an email through my website. I'll have the link there too. I also have a poll on um, the community tab of my uh, channel asking how many people um, would like to see uh, March, uh, Strass Bay or Jig as a tune lesson video. Let me know, um, take, take, take a poll on that and I'll get started on that right away. I have a tune chosen and I'll start working on it soon. Now if, you're, now, if you would like some personalized instruction, I give um, lessons over a number of platforms, including Skype, Zoom, and MS Teams. So I will, have, I will put up a booking um, page on my website so that you don't have to worry about contacting me directly. You can still do that, it's up to you, but that will give you another option to book lessons and to get personalized instruction if there's something that you're not quite sure about, and I'll be adding more services. Uh, to the website uh, soon so that you have more options to learn um, at the pace that works best for you. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.